everyone, Christine Ann here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you are having a wonderful Sunday. And if you are new, thank you for clicking on this video. I really appreciate you being here and I hope you will consider hitting that subscribe button to join my growing YouTube family. Today is day 11 of our virtual mineral advent calendar. Let's see what we have today. Here is our box of the day, something smaller. Feels a little weighty. Ooh, let's take the card out, see what we have. Okay, so this is Boleite with Atacamite and Gypsum. It's from the Amelia Mine um, that's in Baja, California of Mexico. And this happens to come from um, well-arranged molecules. That is uh, Kevin Downey's um, website. Uh, Kevin Downey is um, another dealer that I've bought a number of minerals from, and he has been actually a sort of a wonderful mentor, actually, for me with um, growing my mineral collection. All right, let's put this aside, and let's look at our mineral. Okay, there it is. Um, so this is, let me see, a little better. Okay, this is the boleite. This is the, the green is the atacamite, and the white is gypsum. Now I can tell you, um, and then wait a minute, let's turn over so you actually see it looks more just kind of like rock that's probably gypsum right there oh let me back up a little there it is see those little striations so those are crystals of gypsum i believe this looks like sand and whatnot um rocky matrix okay look at the atacamite all right so um, there it is. Let me, these are actually when they were first um, found and entered the um, market in the mineral community, there was like, you know, a bit of, uh, a little bit of controversy about were these real or were these fake minerals where the boleites was um, taken and glued onto this. So um, it was determined that they were real. And I'm going to, let me see, I'll put it here so you can see it. Okay, super fun. When I was trying to look on my computer, my mouse is not working, and then I had to find a battery, and um, it's still not working, but I looked it up on my phone, so I was able to um, get the information I wanted anyway. They were um, first discovered in 2018 in the um, Amelia Mine, and these showed up at the Tucson um, Gem and Mineral Show that, I guess, the following year, maybe it was 19? Yes, it was 19, because that was the first year that I went, actually. So it was a whole big stir, you know, if these were fake, if these were real, and mineralogists and experts and whatnot um, ultimately determined they were real. So what was the issue? The issue was that this mineral boleite here, you usually find it on very sandy matrix like this, right? So this is um, very fragile. So usually what happens is um, you either find these crystals as just detached from the matrix, just floaters, um, separate, um, or if you find them on matrix, it's usually the blue crystal on something that looks like this, and then the mineral has been, um, what you have to do with the matrix is you have to stabilize it, so you can um, put the mineral in some kind of solution, I mean, essentially like you know, analogous to glue more or less that gets into that and stabilizes it so I can handle it like this because usually you can't. Um, so the fact that these were found and they have this atacamite all over it, the people were wondering if the boleite were free crystals that were taken and glued onto this, right? But what was ultimately determined is if you look up close at the atacamite, it's all these little fine grains. And usually, um, I mean, the, the examples of atacamite I have in my collection are big 
crystals. So what was thought was that atacamite was someplace else. It broke down, floated away, settled on the sandy matrix with the boleite around it. So this is um, a natural occurrence. It is not um, fake. So boleite has copper in it, but it also has um, lead, silver, and other things. So it has a complex mineral composition. Atacamite is a copper secondary mineral, but it also has some chloride in it. So um, they have copper in common, but they're uh, very different. This white one here is gypsum. Um, Technically, um, it is calcium sulfate, and this is um, a very common mineral. It's used for a whole variety of industrial purposes, one of them being making plaster or um, during home construction, things like that. So that's our mineral of the day. Um, that's a good one, something different. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you have um, a wonderful, wonderful day, and I will see you for day 12 tomorrow. Bye. Have a wonderful day.